So I'm an instructor in my main page, my home page, and I want to put links to my three weekly modules, and I want to use images for that. So the way I often do this is to go up and get the text box, and I'm going to have uh, three columns here. I'm going to have two rows and no border. This makes it kind of an invisible text box. I'm going to insert it here. And then you can put in week one, week two, week three across the top, something like this. And then underneath here, you can put in images. So from my image file, I'm going to find my image of, uh, I've got uh, one finger here. There it is. Now it's a little bit too big, so you need to come, I need to go in here and kind of bring it down smaller and smaller and smaller to the size I want it. Um, so you can do that with each image. And once I've got my three images in the three boxes, um, and sometimes I have to uh, save changes and go back a little bit to adjust the sizes because it's a little bit glitchy. Uh, so you can expect that. Then you can make your, uh, you know, you can make your type bold and you can put it in the middle of the box and things like that too. Um, I'm going to do that real quick here. Um, and then if you want to make those images your links, what you do is, um, first of all, ch save changes. And then you come back and you uh, select the image, week one image like this. So you select both of those like that. Go over to your uh, assignments, quizzes, announcements, discussions, modules, and link this to week one, which is in here. Here it is, right here. So that will link to the first module. So you select what you want, select the whole thing here, and then go over to what you want to link to. And if you want to link to just the whole modules list, you can choose that or you can choose the actual week you want it to, uh, to link to. So by selecting uh, and then clicking over here to what you want it to, to link to, you can um, set up your class. So now uh, it looks like this. And if the student clicks on just the image right here, it will take them to where they want to go, this image, this image. Um, and they can also click on the text above. So that's the way that works. If you don't want to worry about the text box, you want to put just one image in, for example, or add several images in and just use those, um, you can put in, for example, a start image. I'm going to uh, click on my image. It's a little bit big here, so I'm going to make it smaller. And uh, as I say start here, I'm just going to select the image uh, like this, go over the top, and I'm going to go to my uh, where I want it to link to. by clicking on links and going down to the modules. And this, I'll just say, this, this will take you right to the modules list. So the start here button right here will take you to the modules. That's another great way to get people started. And one more time from the way it looks afterwards, when someone comes into the course, this, this, this right here is the actual button that takes you to the modules list.